So let's have a look at another plugin, which is the JAR plugin. So you must have seen in my previous sessions, we already ran through this plugin because when we were running the package phase, we, it was packaging all our artifacts into a JAR, JAR file. Now, I did not add anything, any plugin into my POM file, but how did it do it? So by default, uh, Maven includes this JAR plugin in, in the parent POM. So any Maven project you create, it's already present. So when you run the package phase, it packages all your artifacts into a JAR file. Now, saying that, we can also include it explicitly in our POM file if you want to change some configuration. Now, among many others, uh, the two most important ones are the includes, excludes configuration and the manifest configuration. So in the includes, excludes, you can either include any files or exclude any files from your package by mentioning the file types uh, in the configuration and then manifest. So manifest, it's a file which contains some metadata about your project, right? So by default, it is already present in the jar file when you run the package phase. But if you want to uh, create and package your own manifest file, you can mention it in the configuration. So let's see how we can do this, right? So to save some time, I have already added the jar plugin here, right? And I've included a configuration to include the text files for my project, right? And let's go ahead and run this, right? So I'm in my project for directory and run MVN package. So it should package all my um, artifacts into a jar file and keep it in the target folder. So you can see it has created a jar, hello world 1.0 snapshot.jar file in the target folder, right? So let's go back to the target folder and I can see here a jar file is created just now. So let's see if it has got a manifest file. So I'll open this jar and you can see there is a folder called metaenv which contains the manifest file. So when you view this file, you will see. So this is the metadata, manifest version 1.0 created by Maven jar plugin and build JDK spec 14. So which is my JDK version for this project, right? So that's how you create your manifest file in the jar and do some configuration changes. Now the last part, how you can have your own, create your own manifest file, right? So for that, you need to include this archive tag and the manifest file in your pom.xml configuration for the plugin. So under configuration, you can include this. Now to execute this, you need to have this manifest file in this directory in this path, right? So that will um, create a manifest, I mean, it will package your manifest file in the jar, right? If you run the ambient package again. But I'm not going to do that because I don't have this file right now, but you can go ahead and uh, try yourself, right? 